published 1223 EDT, the 2nd of November 2017, updated 1508 EDT, the 2nd of November 2017. She was his lucky charm when the Houston Astros triumphed against the LA Dodgers in the final game of the World Series. And Kate Upton couldn't have looked more proud of her baseball star fiancé Justin Berlander as they walked their pet pooch Harley in Los Angeles, just hours after the team's win on Wednesday night. The model, 25, was positively ecstatic as the soon to boot couple stepped out hand-in-hand -hand after the sportsman, 34, and his Texas-based team helped take the World Series for the first time ever with a 51 win. Scroll down for video in it to win it. Kate Upton couldn't have looked more proud of her fiancé Justin Berlander as they walked their dog Harley in Los Angeles after his World Series when on Wednesday night the actress was still sporting the head Toto Denheim she had worn to the game, but teamed the look with Justin's World Series champs baseball cap in honor of the special occasion. Kate flaunted a fresh-faced glow as she as she held on to her Astros pitcher love with one hand while leading their boxer put with the other. Man of the moment Justin looked handsome in a long-sleeve polo shirt and rust-colored pants while enjoying the career-defining night in a rather low-key way. The couple couldn't wipe the smiles off their faces as they strolled through the city, appearing to shun a wild night of celebratory partying in favor of spending some quality time with their canine companion, plenty to smile about the model, 25, was ecstatic as the Sunto boot couple stepped out hand-in-hand -hand after the sportsman, 34, and his Texas-based team helped take the World Series happy the actress was still sporting the head Toto Denheim she had worn to the game, but teamed the look with Justin's World Series champs baseball cap in honor of the occasion Kate could have been Justin's lucky charm during Wednesday night's final game of the Astros v Dodgers World Series. The blonde was at Dodgers Stadium to cheer on the team as they secured the top title with a 51 win. The Michigan native wore a distressed blue jean jacket that had her boyfriend's name written in across the back. Winner gets a kiss Kate could have been Justin's lucky charm during Wednesday night's final game of the Astros v Dodgers World Series. His lucky charm the 25-year-old blonde was at Dodgers Stadium to cheer on fiancé Justin Saver the moment Kate snapped a selfie on the field after the massive win. Sports Illustrated swimsuit model Kate was in the house for Game 7 in the World Series wore her dark blonde hair loose and tucked behind her ears that had in diamond earrings. Kate slung in small orange purse on a chain across her body and wore a matching shade of lip color. Earlier in the day, it was reported that she and the Astros pitcher planned to tie the knot in Italy later this month. Rooting for her man the 25-year-old blonde was at Dodger Stadium to cheer on fiancé Justin Verlander as the Houston Astros, his team faced off the LA Dodgers in the final game. Pretty Kate wore faded blue jeans decorated with white stars and had on a black t-shirt under her jacket. She wore her dark blonde hair loose and tucked behind her ears. The will marry in Tuscany with the model's sisters Christy and Laura as bridesmaids, U.S. Weekly claimed. The couple announced their engagement at the Met Gala in New York City in May 2016 after dating since 2011. Among the other famous faces at Game 7 was former Destiny's Child star Michelle Williams, actors Jason Bateman and Rob Lowe, who brought along his son John, and comedian George Lopez. It took over half a century, but the Houston Astros World Series win could not have come at a better time for the region. Getting married Verlander, 34, proposed to the model in May of 2016. He's seen during Tuesday night's Game 6 at Dodgers Stadium bear hug Justin wrapped Kate in his arms adore Kate looked up lovingly at him less than three months after the Gulf Coast was slammed by Hurricane Harvey, and with his players wearing an H-Strong logo on their jerseys, Astros owner Jim Crane dedicated the Commissioner's Trophy to the victims. This one is for Houston back there at home and the region, Crane said afterwards. Got hit hard everyone was behind us. While the trophy was dedicated to the fans, it was Astros center fielder George Springer who did most of the heavy lifting. Not only did Springer tie a fall classic record on Wednesday with his fifth home run in the series, but he also led the game off with a double to left before ultimately scoring on a throwing error by Dodgers first baseman Cody Bellinger. Springer won the World Series MVP, which was recently renamed for legendary Giants center fielder Willie Mays. Double take Kate rocked double denim as she smiled broadly apparel. Kate donned a World Series cap for a moment so in love the two looked so in love smooch as Justin planted a big one on Kate so happy the couple looked to be so happy with the big win. The Connecticut native finished the series hitting .37911 for 29 with three doubles, five homers, seven RBI and eight runs scored, becoming the first player ever to reach those totals in a single World Series. That Houston strong patch on our chest truly does mean a lot to us, Springer said. I'm so happy for our fans who endured a lot. Added Astros manager AJ Hinch Houston, we're a championship city. This team loves playing in Houston and we're going to love bringing this trophy back to Houston. We take great pride in being there for Houston, Hinch said. 
They responded by falling in love with this team. Springer tied the World Series home run mark set by Reggie Jackson in 1977 and matched by Chase Utley in 2009 by connecting for a record fourth game in a row. The homer gave the Astros an early 50 lead. Selfie Queen the cover girl took a selfie laughs abound. The couple shared more laughs as the excitement grew the look of love again. They gazed into each other's eyes more pics. The couple couldn't stop taking selfies.